Hello again, I am Blunty. Now the video I had planned to make today was going to be an insightful exploration of the human condition. It was going to wow you. Your jaw would be slack with amazement. You would stare off into the distance and your mind would twirl with wonder and glory of the human existence. But instead I found an article that lets me talk about boobs for a little while and, um, well let's face it, talking about boobs on the internet is always more popular than talking about, you know, something intelligent. The good news is this new story about boobs is about science and medicine, so you just might learn something helpful as well as talking about boobs and thinking about boobs, because whenever you say the word boobs, what springs to your mind? Images of boobs. You can't help but think about boobs when someone says boobs, because boobs is one of the most fun words in the English language to say. I love saying boobs. It's so much better than breasts or tits, Gonzagas. Fun bag, sweater gittens. Anyway, back to the article. Doctors say looking at busty women for 10 minutes a day is good for your health. Staring at busty women can lengthen your life. Scientists have proved. Scientific proof that staring at tits makes you live longer. Unless, of course, you have a girlfriend with rather green eyes, as it were. In which case, your life will be quite a lot shorter and filled with misery and pain and shouting and... and dirty looks and and sleeping on the far side of the bed and all that sort of stuff. A German study, and you know those German scientists, efficient scientists, very clever German medical scientists. You can trust a German, usually. A German study published in the New England Journal of Medicine concludes that staring at women's breasts for just a few minutes a day is better for your health than going to the gym. I can look at tits for 10 minutes and it's better for me. I will live longer than some roided up gym junkie that burns away hours of his precious life plodding along on a treadmill. Just 10 minutes of looking at the charms of a well-endowed female is equivalent to a 30 minutes aerobic workout. I can look at tits for 10 minutes and get better health effects than doing aerobics for half an hour. That's brilliant says author Dr. Karen Weatherby, an expert on aging. She's an expert on aging, and she guarantees that looking at tits will make you age slower, or live longer at least. The research team led by Dr. Weatherby spent five years monitoring the effects of this unique discovery. Oh, good glorious God to be in that medical study. Five years of, welcome back, Mr. Burr, please take a seat. Look at my tits. How do you feel? Well, doctor, pretty good. They're, um, nice tits. A medical study where the correct answer is, nice tits, I feel great. Brilliant. I love science. Science is awesome. The men who were told to stare at bosoms daily had lower blood pressure and slower resting pulse rates and also a decreased risk of coronary artery disease. Looking at boobies is good for my heart and my soul. Dr. Weatherby explained, sexual excitement gets the heart pumping and improves blood circulation. Especially in your pants. She didn't say that, but it was just left hanging at the end of that sentence. Improves blood circulation. The obvious gag is a dick joke. But I'd rather think about boobs. Because thinking about boobs makes me live longer than thinking about dicks. Apparently. I wonder if there's been another study about women who think about dicks. Cock health. There's no question, gazing at large breasts makes men healthier and happier, again, still. She also recommends that men over 40 should spend at least 10 minutes daily admiring breasts sized D cups or larger. So apparently the older you get, the bigger the breasts are you have to look at every day in order to get the full medical effect of uh, tit watching, boob staring. So every lecherous bugger out there, you now know what to do. Hit up the link in the video description, save it to your bookmarks, and now, every time a woman catches you staring at her boobs, you can just say, no, no, I was looking at your breasts for my health. It's doctor's orders. I want to live as long as possible. But I have to look at your boobs to do it. And better yet, if your girlfriend catches you looking at someone else's boobs, there's a valid excuse there too. Sorry, honey, no, I was just trying to live longer so I could spend more days with you because our time together is so precious and lovely. And her boobs are bigger than yours. 
so I live slightly longer looking at those than I will at yours. Oh God, I've made a horrible mistake. So I'm just left here wondering, is it better to look at real breasts or pictures of breasts? I don't know. I'm going to have to fund my own medical study. I need a dedicated team of people to work with me and just look at boobs all day long and tell me how you're feeling and how your heart's doing. And another thought, we're lesbians out there. I don't know whether this study addresses you because obviously you are sexually attracted to boobs as well, being girls who like girls and everybody likes boobs really. But do, do you have to be a male to reap the benefits of the longer life boob watching medical regime? Do lesbians live longer when they look at boobs as well? Can we be immortal if we just make everyone walk around topless all the time? Live forever, boobs all over the place! What about the homosexual men out there? Do man boobs have the same effect as girl boobs when it comes to that? Or, or, or do they have to look at penises instead? Or what about women who are straight? Obviously boobs don't generally do much for them in the sexual excitement kind of things, unless they're their own and you're playing with them and stuff, of course. But does looking at penises have the same longevity effects on women that, it, that looking at boobs do on men? There are so many questions opened up by this medical study that need answering. I need people out there to help me. Look at boobs, look at penises, look at bums, look at all kinds of naughty things. I'm not entirely sure that I want to live a really, really long life on this planet seeing as there are so many crappy things about being alive, but if I am going to live, however long I'm going to live, even if it extends my life, I will be looking at boobs anyway. I mean, it's not as if this, this, this medical revelation is suddenly going to make me think, I need to look at more boobs, because I'm a heterosexual male and I look at boobs anyway. Even when I'm not thinking about it, you see a girl on the street, she's wearing a low-cup top, you go, oh, boobs, and you try not to stare and get caught because that's creepy and awkward and stuff, and, you know, you catch it out of your corner, right? I mean, they won't, if they didn't want you to look at their boobs, they wouldn't wear a low-cup top if they were shy about it, but, you know, you don't have to be creepy about it, you know, hey, you know, that kind of stuff, you can... Just admire them briefly. Don't stare or anything, because, oh, I tell you, it's awkward being a dude, because you, you know, women dress to be attractive, but then you feel awkward because you look at the attractive girl, and then she sees you looking, and then she thinks you're creepy because you're staring at her, but she dressed to be attractive, but it's all a very complex sociological issue, and I'm just trying to live longer. Show me your boobs, for Christ's sake, please. <sighs> I should have made the video I was intending to make, because this is just gibberish, really. But, you know, boobs. Thanks for watching, I am Blunty, and I will boobs you next time. Boobs. 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 Boobs.